That's what makes DC very successful, the fact that two outside backs can get into the attack. Interesting how DC United, much like Houston, can get a guy from another team and all of a sudden they blossom in their organization. Gomez will try it off the crossbar. The volley and a goal. Luciano Emilio has hit his 20th goal. United are up 4-0. Are you kidding? Five-star entertainment here in the second half. You have got to be kidding me. Look at this ball. Bending, dropping right into that post. Can't do anything about it. But look at Emilio hitting that ball. First time out of the year in the back of the net. Getting his 20th goal of the year. Leading the lead. But you got to say to yourself, when things are going your way, they're going your way. When you talk about a classic finisher in front of the goal, this is what you get. Great set piece. The awareness, putting yourself in the right spot and hitting that ball out of the air like that is absolutely great, fantastic finishing. Four goals in 18 minutes for DC United. Fred has just hit the sweetest of volleys, spearing it out of midair. He's got his 20th. It is a route. Four to one. Yeah, and you can thank Jaime Moreno and Ben Olsen for coming into this game picking up the intensity, organizing that team that struggled the first half, and putting them on the board for nothing. Yeah, now only if, one. only if Tom Sung could get them both off and rest them for the Chivas game on yeah. Tuesday. So here's your goal scoring leader in Major League Soccer, Luciano Emilio, the Brazilian with 20, followed by Juan Pablo Angel of the New York Red Bulls. So they're gonna do the Y 